Ken Armstrong, I'm the president and CEO of West Haven Gold, and I'm here with Peter Fischel, our chief, chief, geologist. chief geologist with West Haven. Um, today we're standing right now on the Franz deposit, this beautiful outcrop of low sulfidation um, epithermal gold mineralization. Um, this is the third deposit on the uh, West Haven's flagship shovel nose gold property. It's one of the deposits that was used in the March 2025 preliminary economic assessment of shovel nose that shows that this is a real uh, potential um, high margin underground gold mining opportunity. And this is cool because as opposed to the south zone, which is the southernmost of the deposit, which is under 50 to up to 100 meters of overburden here, it's right at surface. Um, being at surface was really important in the PEA because what it means is that our underground portal will be collaring very close to mineralization. And in combination with the FMN deposit, which is between Franz and the South Zone, it means we're able to bring uh, uh, mining and production forward by 12 months in the PEA. Um, being able to find this, Peter, like maybe you could take us through how it was found. Obviously it's an outcrop and its importance in terms of maybe the potential for additional discovery on the property. Yeah, so um, back in July of um, uh, 2020, by then we had uh, about a two kilometer long strike length drilled off for vein zone one. And we kind of then kind of were just looking at a geology map and projected that tread northwest into an area where uh, there was like similar rocks uh, that had been found um, that uh, the BC Geological Survey mapped similar to what we were getting in the south zone area. So, so um, back in, uh, yeah, again, in July, it was a slow day in the core shack. So we sent one of our drill core loggers, one of our younger geos out here. And on, uh, I believe it was August 2nd, uh, he actually came across this outcrop and took some grab samples. And uh, uh, when we came, got the assays back, they came back, you know, uh, just over 50 grams per ton gold. So we were kind of, um, yeah, saying, you know, this is something <laughs> major happening here. So, uh, and it kind of points to the potential. This is only found, um, again, in, in 2020, uh, after, uh, you know, almost a decade of drilling on shovel nose. So it kind of points to the fact that, yeah, getting boots on the ground, you know, getting um, a grassroots uh, program, grassroots exploration happening out here, that's still an important uh, part of the um, program we're doing up here. So, and shovel nose is a big property and there's still lots of uh, uncovered ground to be, uh, you know, looking at. So there's still potential for more, more of these lurking out here somewhere. So yeah, it's definitely um, an eye-opening, um, you know, uh, scenario here. It just, I mean, it's just a matter of getting boots on the ground, even though, it's been, uh, we have a resource here now um, and it, you know, it's been extensively drilled, but there's still potential for so much more, you know, uh, discoveries like this uh, on Shelbonos here. Yeah. Fantastic. And that's what we're trying to do with the summer 2025 drill program is testing areas where we see um, similar indications structurally and in geophysics, pathfinder elements, all of those uh, ingredients that, that we see around the known deposits. We're using, utilizing those as vectors to target for the drilling that's underway right now.